Now let's look at our new Xeon W processors in action. We all know that reality capture is becoming ubiquitous in many fields, architecture, city planning, movie making, and game development. These types of workflows highlight the compute power that is required for engineers and creatives to bring their visions closer to reality. Let's look at a workflow created by the 3D artist, Stefan Ivanov, to recreate our headquarters in Santa Clara. This process starts by taking hundreds of high-res images and importing them into one of many reality capture tools available. In this example, we're going to use the software called Reality Capture by Epic Games to create a point cloud. However, our headquarters has a lot of reflective windows, which is a challenge for this type of reality capture. To make a more accurate model, we're going to use the point cloud data to create an accurate blockout model of the area in Autodesk 3ds Max, including the locations of the reflective windows to create a more realistic looking model. We can now break the model into modules in 3ds Max and use the scanned data to bake the textures onto those models. The next step is to take the data into Substance 3D Painter by Adobe to prepare the texture set for the full PBR materials, which contain the needed texture information for tools like Unreal Engine 5 to make a rock look like a rock and an ear look like an ear. All of this allows us to digitally recreate a version of the Santa Clara headquarters, ready to import into other tools. Now let's load the model into Unreal. This whole workload has benefited greatly from the increased performance of our Xeon W processors, enabling creators to iterate more quickly and see the direct results of their choices faster. Now let's see how that model import into Unreal turned out. Virtual production is transforming the media and entertainment industry. Intel is proud to work with the leading companies that are driving virtual production, ensuring they have the processing power and I.O. capabilities in their workstations to meet their constantly evolving needs, both now and in the future. Film directors need to see in real time what's happening in the scene, and they need to be able to quickly move or change background details. And as their scenes grow in complexity, they require more powerful workstations. Hey, wait, this is the old logo. We're not supposed to use this anymore. Uh, can someone please fix this? Thank you. Now, we spend most of every day at the corporate office, but let's go someplace a little more exciting. This is cool, but how about something with a little more nightlife? Now this is more like, hey, wait a second. I recognize this place. This is dystopian future danger alley with all the special effects turned on and with the giant mutant monster dogs. Great. Maybe this detour was a bad idea. We better get back to the office. But before we go, this whole production was shot at an in-camera VFX studio. In-camera VFX production is a sea change for television and films used for real-time composition and set changes and dynamic movable lighting for the most demanding production needs. Unlike green screens, this allows the actors to fully interact with their environment and create a more natural performance. This whole volume is powered by Intel and the VFX set is driven by our new Intel Xeon W processors.